And so this blog article says this phrase can hurt your resume synonyms to use for quote responsible for. So my hot take is that every single job seeker listening to this needs to hit control F on their Microsoft Word and look for responsible for and obliterate that, remove that completely from your resume. This not only makes you look weaker as a job seeker, um, but this just ends up kind of giving you more of a verbose uh, professional experiences section. And you can just really get a lot more power by integrating the action verbs in your resume. So Cheyenne Jubert says, speak about yourself the way you'd speak about a friend. Think about how you'd promote your friend to your supervisor if they applied for a position at your company. You wouldn't say Timmy is responsible for his client's investments because it's too general and underplays Timmy's impact. A better way to explain Timmy's career would be that he, quote, championed a $3 million portfolio for a Fortune 500 company. So think about the ways that you would communicate your experience. And as job seekers, as professionals, I should say, we are taking action and we're doing so much work and effort. So make sure to put those action verbs up front and remove the phrasing that is um, just weak and responsible for definitely falls within that category. So this is a short episode, but I want to make sure to link that within the description, link those blog articles within the description of this episode. And are there any questions you have? Submit um, either something through Let's Eat Grandma or reach out to me on LinkedIn. And I would love to review what questions you have and come up with an episode if that, uh, if that works for our publishing schedule. We really are open to the questions that you have. And I want to make sure that we're addressing these things in a way uh, that makes sense for you.